The Batavia Max Spray will take painting to the next level. Let us tell you why. Now we are not going to ask you if painting your house takes way too long using a roller and brush. We already know you think so. The Max Spray is an easy to use paint spray. Just fill it up and get the job done. This very affordable machine is not just meant for the pros. Anyone can use it. Whether you are working inside or outside, the Max Spray will help you on nearly all surfaces and with pretty much every type of paint. With the adjustable nozzle, you can easily spray horizontal or vertical, getting to all those spots which are difficult to reach with a brush. It's just a lightweight, comfortable to use machine that will make your life a whole lot easier. And while you are still thinking whether you should buy one, we already finished the job. Before spraying, you need to assemble the product simply. Then push the front body part inward. Before use, measure the paint concentration. It is best to control it below 50 in. Three spray patterns by simply adjusting the location of iron cap, circular, vertical, horizontal. Circular shape is suitable for sides, corners. Vertical shape is for horizontal object surface. Horizontal shape is for vertical object surface. By adjusting the flow knob to control the flow rate. According to different project requirements, you can choose different nozzle sizes and the replacement is very simple. This paint sprayer is very versatile. It can be used to spray iron products such as garden iron fences, doors, roofs, garage doors, iron shelves and so on. It can also be used for wooden products such as fences, tables, chairs, wooden boards, etc. Furniture, the power land adhesion is strong and the surface spraying effect is very good. After finishing spraying, remove the container and just do simple cleaning. Put a corresponding thinner and perform a similar spraying operation. The purpose is to clean the remaining paint in the pipes and nozzles. Then remove the container and clean all parts. Are you still hesitating about such a great paint sprayer? The first thing I noticed about the 3M performance coating gun was the versatility of it. It felt good in my hand. And then when you start throwing in the materials, everything just kind of comes together. My name is John Wimpy. I'm the head painter here at Schaefer Auto Body Center, South County, Missouri. 
Hello, my name is Adam Fulkerson. I'm the head painter at Schaefer Auto Body. My name is James. I've been a painter here at Schaefer Auto Body Center for four years. Uh, my name is Jason Nix. I am a painter here at Schaefer Creve Corps in St. Louis. The things that have surprised me the most about the 3M Performance spray gun is the material efficiency. We pride ourselves on profit here, and that helps big time with it. We are probably 20% less, which is a huge dollar amount. I would say the material savings has meant a lot to this job and to the shop. First thing I noticed about the 3M spray gun was that it was, it was real lightweight, sprayed real smooth. I really liked the final outcome of it. It atomized the paint well, really good transfer efficiency. The 3 and spray gun compares well with other guns I've sprayed with in the past. The thing that surprised me the most with the 3M gun was my nemesis colors. The colors that I just went in the booth and didn't really fight, but, you know, would struggle to make them meet my standards. I went in there with that gun and three less coats and the, the paint job was done. The first thing I noticed about the 3M Performance spray gun was how lightweight it was. Some of the challenges that I face as a painter is hand fatigue. Being in the booth all day, carrying a gun, holding it over roof, hood, they get heavy and your hands start hurting. It just seemed to really help with the hand fatigue for me. The coatings I've been sprayed with the Performance Spray Gun, I've started with primer, sealer, base coat, all the way up to clear coat. It all seems to be atomizing well. I use the 1.4 tip with the primer, the 1.3 for my sealer, the 1.2 for solid base colors, the 1.3 for metallic base colors and then the one three also for clear coat application. The Performance Spray Gun has definitely saved me time as far as cleaning the gun after each use. It's a lot quicker, the tips clean off real well. After a few weeks, you can toss them out, get a brand new one. If I was explaining to a painter why they should try the 3M Performance Spray Gun, I would just let them know that the material savings is enough for you to go forward. Today we're going to be doing a what's in the box video featuring Fuji's DIY series of spray systems. Within the DIY series we have our Semi Pro 2 and Hobby Pro 2 spray systems which are great entry level systems for the homeowner or professional. Now there's going to be three main components to every HVLP turbine driven spray system. The first component, your air hose. The second component is going to be your HVLP spray gun. And the third and final component is going to be the HVLP turbine itself. So the first component of your HVLP spray system is going to be your air hose. Now Fuji, we offer a 25 foot high flex blue air hose with a kink free spring, a quick connect coupling, as well as an air control valve which allows you to adjust the inlet pressure going to the spray gun. The next component of your HVLP system is going to be the HVLP spray gun itself. Now with every DIY series system you're going to get an M model spray gun. This is a non-bleed pressurized spray gun with a 1.3 millimeter air cap set a rear situated pattern control, as well as a comfortable stay cool handle for cooler operating spray experience. Now when you purchase a Semi Pro, you're going to have your choice of either the M model bottom feed or M model gravity feed spray gun. Now whichever orientation you do choose, you can also convert these back to either bottom or gravity feed and vice versa. Now the M model spray guns are going to come in air cap sets ranging from 0.8 to 2.0 millimeters, and you're also going to get a detailed user manual a cleaning brush, a gun wrench, and most importantly, your viscosity cup. So the final component of your HVLP turbine driven system is the turbine itself. Now here we have the Semi Pro 2. Inside this case is a powerful 1400 watt two stage motor operating at approximately 5 psi. On the side here you're going to notice some quick change friction fit filters as well as a convenient gun holder for storage after your spray day. Now before we wrap the DIY series, I do want to tell you about the final offering, which is the Hobby Pro 2. So the Hobby Pro 2 is very similar to the Semi Pro in power and performance. Uh, in terms of the turbine, the most notable difference is that the case is black. Uh, other than that, the spray gun comes installed with a 1.8 millimeter air cap set, which is great for spraying most of the higher viscosity finishes like latex paints, for instance. Uh, when purchasing the Hobby Pro 2, you're going to get some added value in your system with some consumable packs. This consumable pack is your friction fit quick change filters, and this one is a bottom feed cup parts kit which contains consumables for your M model spray gun. So that covers the DIY series. If this was Jim from Fuji Spray, thank you so much for watching.